Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 29 of the Adobe InDesign tutorial series and today what we are going to do is we're going to create text outlines which is similar to how expand shapes work inside of Adobe Illustrator if you've used Illustrator. So for that I'm going to create a text right here and I'm going to type in tutor tube right here and I'm going to select the text just like this and then I'm going to select a font just like this. So I'm going to select this out, I'm going to increase the font size over here to so something like 60 and you can see that the shape is there. So I can select the shape over here and then I'm going to go to type and going to go to uh, click on create outline. So that creates an outline. So over here, if you were to select the direct selection tool, you can see the points right here. You can also edit this with pen tool as we saw in the last lesson because these are shapes. So if I were to click and drag over here, let's say for example, I'm on my direct selection tool. Um, so click and, uh, and drag in and you can see that I can actually modify the shape as if uh, it was a regular shape. That is because the fonts are shaped, designed by other designers over there. So now, uh, usually I want to expand shape when I want to add in some pictures in the, inside the text or something. I can do that by going on to place and then going on to a file menu and place right here. I'm going to select a picture that I want to input, press open, and then you can see that the picture is there. So what I can do is I can go uh, over here on the selection tool and you can see that uh, the picture actually appears inside right over there. So I can use the same tools as the picture fitting. So I'm going to fit frame to content right here. So you can see that I got the picture right there. All right. And that's how the picture actually comes in. So I can also go to place over here and then select another picture. And then you can see that the other picture actually comes in. So that's how you can add in pictures inside the text itself. And that is the use of text outline. So you can create some very unique designs with it and add in textures to your pictures just like that. You can add in a drop shadow as well uh, to create a quick design. So that is how uh, creating text outline works inside of Adobe InDesign. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.